Which guys got a quick video here for you. This one's been asked for quite a lot and I sort of put it off because it's so simple really but I thought I'd make a quick video just to clear it up and it's how to create a Kaspersky Rescue CD10 on a USB drive so you can boot from that. So what we've got here is you need to come to this site and get a Kaspersky Rescue Disk 10 and what we're going to do is put this onto our USB thumb drive and it's pretty straightforward really this is why I've been putting it off but um, all you need to do here is have a um, USB thumb drive and then you need to download your version now once you've got your thumb drive in you need to format to FAT32 we're going to do that in a second and then you need to download your ISO image you can do that by clicking on this one here it's 237 megabytes you also need the utility to actually put that uh, Kaspersky Rescue Disk 10 onto your USB device and you can download that from there okay so now we've got that done I will put this link in the description for you so now what we need to do is get our thumb drive ready and as you can see I've got my thumb drive in here and uh, what I'm going to do is right click on this and I'm going to come down to format now once we've got this uh, up we need to get it onto FAT32 and I'm going to format this drive now you can call this what you want you can call this Kaspersky Rescue CD whatever you want inside the label there I'm going to do a quick format on this one click start it's going to warn you and say all the data on this drive will be formatted we're going to say OK here OK so that was a quick format I'm going to click OK the drives now ready for Kaspersky now we could have renamed this to something uh, like Kaspersky or something like that if we wished um, but we're going to be happy to leave it like that okay so now we've done that what we're going to do here is I've got my files downloaded and you can see I've got my Kaspersky Rescue Disk 10 on my desktop here and I've also got the utility which they provide for you to actually get it onto your USB thumb drive so what we're going to do is right click on this and run this as administrator I'm going to say install here and it will pop up this window all we need to do here now is uh, locate our ISO image and we can do that by clicking on browse then mine's located on my desktop and there it is there so I'm going to click on that then click open now this is the next part we want to make sure if you've got many uh, USB drives plugged in you want to make sure that you've got the right one selected in this case mine is E and you can do that by checking on here really and you can see it's E and what we're going to do is click start okay that's now all complete as you can see click OK here and we can now close this off we should now be able to see all the files inside of our USB thumb drive now once you boot to this what's going to happen is you're going to get the same um, display as you would if you was booting up on a CD okay so I think that's about it for this video so I hope you enjoyed it my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk if you enjoy these videos guys hit that subscribe button and show your support by rating and favouring my videos and I'll be making more useful videos again in the future. So thanks again for watching guys, bye for now.